fun fact, before this Alabama spring game, I put money on um, Alabama to lose this game. It was Alabama or the field, and I picked the field. So, uh, let's go field. Hold on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Scoring system. Off. Okay, sure. I'll just figure it out as I go. Maybe. That field is looking interesting, though. I don't know. It's not looking in too good a shape. Jesus. See how Milrow's looking this year. Wait. Wow, I'm surprised they didn't call that a sack back there. I thought Milrow was going to be getting hit until I saw the black jersey. Okay, Field, you gotta pick it up, dude. As an LSU fan, man, I'm just, uh... I'm looking for any weaknesses I can find, man. The running back room, I feel like, is not gonna be one of them. Damn, man. Yeah, their running backs are gonna be hard to stop, huh? Wow. He threw that into triple coverage. You know, I'm just sitting here watching this, and I just remembered that Nick Saban's not the coach anymore, man. It's, it's so weird to even think about that. Wow. Today, who was a board of trustee who did a great job for the university, and you know, we did put our captain's hand and footprint in the dirt. So, um, all those things are great traditions, and it's good to be back and be a part of it. Are you going to be able to watch and enjoy as a fan? Are you going to be writing down some coaches' notes <laughs> while you're up in the box watching? What are you going to be doing? My, my biggest concern is being with um, my head coach, Miss Terry. <laughs> never ever had to watch a game with her so I'm a little concerned last question coach why is this team in the right hands with Kalen DeBoer for the future yeah, well Kalen's a great coach and I know there's been some disruptions uh, based on you know me leaving him coming but uh, he's going to do a great job the players are in good hands and I think they'll do a great job of recruiting and probably need to get some guys out of the portal like everybody else at this time of year but I'm excited for the future all right thank you coach enjoy the game with Miss Terry this right here is a weird sight Kaylin DeBoer or anybody else other than Saban wow Jesus tackle hold on Maybe the defense is a weakness. Maybe the defense is a weakness. I didn't think about that. I thought... Hold on. Hold on. Maybe I'm on to something here. Because that was not very good tackling on that last play. Or this. That's not good. I know you don't learn a whole lot about a team in the spring game. But I'm going to ignore that. <clears throat> For now. Okay, that was pretty solid. Wait, that was a first down? Uh, he needed a yard. Yeah, they're running the ball quite a bit. I... I would assume... Bama's offense has got... Oh! It's gonna look similar to last year. Run heavy, because that running back room is... Whoa! Jesus! Um... Wait, did they not... They don't put defense on for the field goals? That's interesting. Unless I was blind and just didn't see it. My god. Holy smokes! Good block. What am I talking about good block for, Luke? Damn. I'm forgetting who I'm watching here. Brother. See 
Seth just trying to grab onto his jersey to slow him down, but that's not going to work. It's another touchdown for Jim Miller. I mean, Bama did lose Caleb Downs. They lost Kool-Aid. They lost um, Terry and Arnold, I think, right? Yeah, that's going to be a sack back. Arnold's not there anymore, is he? Off the edge to go along with Robinson, who's likely going to be the starter. But situationally, those guys, man, with their ability to affect. Oh, yeah. Third down and nine for Milrow. Pressure backside. Flags are down. This will be holding. Milrow throws it away. LSU at Tennessee at yep at Death Valley baby pretty interesting when you look that up you still got to kind of look twice right do a double take you see Alabama Oklahoma on the schedule typical Alabama three steps low down. snap well, think about some of the just drop pass hold on I'm seeing something player -led accountability is enormous. And that's something oh my that god Alabama's always been good at. Kendrick Law, yeah, he's he's going to be a problem. I remember him last, that was offside. Damn, is that another bad snap? No, he was, oh. Picked. Oh my goodness. They try to run the ball here on third and goal. Daniel Hill going nowhere. Stacked up at the line of scrimmage. Whatever. Clean it up. Close enough. Crimson Tide. Crimson. Yeah, there is no defense. I was not blind. All right. We're going to show me something about being infinitely me. I mean, who else would I be? The hell? It's right in the end zone. If you forget it. Right, right over there. As the backup, and then eventually the starter winning a championship. Is Ty Simpson ready to be that guy should something happen to Jalen Milrow in terms of injury? Simpson oh my god! That boy was coming in hot! Pocket breaking down, and Milrow on the run, and they'll blow it dead. Continuing to get more consistent throwing the football, I think he's taking huge strides in that area. 47. Months. Here's Austin Mack out there and he dumps it off to Adam Thorslin. And don't worry about trying to create the big plays. Hey, second and four is great down the distance for us as a play call. Who's number who's number ten? That's what I'm trying to figure out. Moments ago we just showed a promo. Is that Mac? I can't tell. I don't know if he's enrolled yet or not. Damn. We'll see if there's still some kicking woes. So it's understandable it's kind of progressed that way. No row from the pocket. A strike. Short of the line to gain. No, for a while there, uh, kicking was not exactly a strong suit for Bam under Nick Saban. Will Reichard was not bad though. I mean he missed that kick against Tennessee, which is memorable. Um but other than that, I don't remember him being that bad. He's like the leading scorer in Alabama history or something like that, isn't he? I might be just spouting nonsense, but... Bro, I'm... I'm seeing some, uh... Floppiness. Why do I see a D. Smith? Why do I see a D. Smith? Don't be showing me that shit. And he's wearing number six? Hell no, I'm out of here, man. I ain't looking at that shit again.